It's been a tumultuous year in Iran. The nation has seen a surge in public dissent towards the government's theocratic rule. It all started last year with the death of Masa Amini, a 22-year-old woman who was arrested by Iran's morality police for the improper wearing of her hijab. Since then, the country has witnessed a number of arrests of public figures who have spoken out against the government. Now, two more Iranians have been arrested and sentenced to 21 years in prison for an act of simple joyousness. Astayaz Hajigi, 21, and her fiancé, Amir Mohammad Ahmadi, 22, are Instagram influencers with nearly 1 million followers each. On November 1, 2022, they posted a clip on social media of them dancing by the Azadi Tower in the capital city of Tehran. The next day, they were arrested, presumably due to the public nature of their display of joy. The Iranian state media outlet Mizan reported that they were not detained for dancing but for stoking resistance against the country's regime in their Instagram posts. The two were allegedly encouraging people to riot and had published a call for a rally on November 4. In response, a Tehran court sentenced Hajigi and Ahmadi to 10 years and 6 months each, for a total of 21 years. As part of their sentence, they are banned from social media and not allowed to leave the country for two years. This story is emblematic of a greater trend in the country. Iranians have been standing up against the government, yet those who bring attention to it are facing severe punishments for their efforts. This includes the arrests of prominent actor Tarana Aladusti and celebrity chef Navab Ibrahimi. This story presents a vivid picture of the struggles in Iran today. While singers face punishment for trying to express joy and connect with one another, the government still refuses to address the issues that have caused disarray among its citizens. This injustice must not be tolerated. Let's come together as an international community and demand that the Iranian government grant its citizens the freedom they deserve.